Hey, Tyler. Uh, just want to ask you overall the, um, the play of the, the outfield, the three of you this week. Can you describe the importance and wins of you guys producing, whether it's at the plate or in the field, and how kind of fun it is for the three of you to do it together? For sure. Uh, I mean, yeah, this is the first time that, uh, you know, Harry, uh, Dylan, and myself have really had a stretch of games together. And, um, you know, we're just figuring out how to put it all together. And, um, you know, it's a long year, so you got to stick with it. And uh, the, results will, the results will come. So, uh, you know, we trust our training and uh, just going out there and doing our thing. Thanks, Tyler. Hey, Tyler, how soupy was it out there today? Sorry? How soupy was it out there today? Did you have a breeze and wool? Um, soupy is like muggy or? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it was, hot. It, was, it was definitely hot out there for sure. Um, yeah, a little humid. I mean, but middle of the summer, right? So uh, got to deal with it. Uh, you know, training staff keeps us hydrated and stuff. So uh, everyone does a good job. Can you kind of describe maybe even this series, just some of the, I don't know, if frustrations with some of the outcomes or the strike zone, or it just seemed to be like a bit of today with point home. Yeah, I mean, strike zone's a strike zone. Um, all you can ask for is consistency back there, whether they're calling off or not. Um, just so you know the zone, really. Um, I mean, it is what it is. That's the game, right? It's going gonna, it's gonna to fluctuate a little bit here and there, so all you can do is stick with it and uh, stick to the middle of the plate and not miss your pitch. Um, yeah, that's it. I mean, there's not too much not too much going on there for me. And the last thing I want to ask you about is just that, that inning, the seven-run inning, as it kind of builds. I mean, the, the, you guys have talked a lot about the improvements you've made really over the last month offensively and what that inning kind of showed Sure. Yeah. I mean, we're a good hitting ball club. We got a we got a good lineup. So, um, you know, we're 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 feeling good in there. Um, you know, it's just it's just a matter of time before we collectively hit as a unit. Um, yeah. I mean, that's that's just that's nothing nothing surprising to me, honestly. Uh, Zach. Uh, kind of off that. I mean, how much does the outfield itself kind of build off each other and kind of take energy from each other? And you guys are not just able to to play next to each other, but able to you know produce next to. Each other. Yeah, sure. Uh, you know, Dill Dill sets a tone on top of the order lately, so uh, you know he's doing a great job up there. And Harry's been having a having a great uh, you know second half so far. So since he's been coming off the injured list there, so um, you know I'm just continuing to do my thing, trying to stay as consistent as possible. Uh, it's, it's a long year, you know. It's really the first year that I feel like I've had more than well close to 300 at bats, I guess. Um, and so just really learning for me to, to stay mentally engaged and make those daily adjustments and staying consistent with it and, and just being a pro in there is uh, you know, something that I'm really learning this year and um, something that I uh, feel like I'm gonna continue to learn over the course of the next couple of years as well. So just putting together uh, consistent at bats over the course of a season is gonna be very important. Thank you. Okay, we'll let Tyler go just hold on and we'll have uh...